The eruption of a volcano in Iceland is still underway this morning. The government said it could last for months. Sofia Batitsa, with our partners at the BBC, is near the scene, about 30 miles from the capital. This is as close as we could get to the volcano before the authorities stopped us. Now, it's very cloudy this morning, so it's quite hard to see the volcano in the distance. But overnight, more lava has been flowing, and the authorities here are asking people not to come to this area for their safety, but also to allow scientists and responders to assess the situation on the ground. Now, the authorities here say that this eruption does not pose a threat to life. And so far, there have been no reports of any of any injuries. The biggest risk for people who live near the volcano are volcanic fumes. They're not dangerous, but they can be very uncomfortable for elderly people or for people with breathing problems. Now, we spoke to a local police officer and she told us that the priority now is to try and save the town of Grindavik. It was evacuated a few weeks ago as a precaution, but there are risks now that the lava could damage the town. And so the police are working on a plan to go back to people's houses and collect the most valuable belongings. So the people who have been evacuated are probably not going to be able to get back to their homes anytime soon. Sofia Bettiza, BBC News for CBS Mornings in Voga, Iceland.